Some say the world will end in fire. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back. Today we're doing a little bit of a different thing here. I was watching my buddy Zenzul, who I've linked before, check him out, um, watch uh, Marksman Hunter, and I asked him, how is that? And he said it's actually quite fun. And uh, yeah, so I figured I'm going to level, or at least going to try to level one myself, and maybe take this as an opportunity to uh, talk about some other things as well. And specifically today, I want to ask two things of you. Number one, if you enjoy this content, you know, I was talking about a little bit other things while I'm getting some leveling done, because leveling on myself, I think I'm just going to kill myself. Uh, do let me know in the comments, but also I want to talk about if for you guys, the classic expansion or the classic servers coming back this summer, is hype or wipe and you know specifically or more in detail are you guys gonna play it and why but also i'm really interested in uh knowing if you had played classic before when you joined warcraft he's running away come back i might get rid of uh, the pet in a moment um, I myself have played World of Warcraft since the beta, actually. I was uh, one of the first guys playing the game in the world, I suppose. Got a beta key, checked it out, loved it from the get-go. I uh, had a little bit of time when that happened. My then-girlfriend, now wifey, went to, I think, to China for a trip. So I had, uh, I think, like three weeks or so to play, you know, outside of work, of course, and uh, I leveled I leveled quite fast. I was one of the f first level 40s on my level. I remember, on my on my server, I remember, um, you know, turning 40, and I think at that point you were able to um, equip head gear, like a helmet or something. But um, there weren't any on the auction house. There were like a couple of gray items, but no greens. At my level, there were, it was some lower level stuff, you know, not helmets, I believe. I believe that was level 40 at that point. But um, yeah, I was quite, was quite curious and so, so much different, obviously, um, to, to what it is like now. Where you can just buy anything at any given time, whenever you want. So, um, yeah, so I have gone through some of the things that will be coming back. And yeah, so specifically, I want to talk about two things today. While hopefully, I can take care of this guy as well. Number one is, which I am looking forward to, is that the community, I think, out of necessity... Hey, I level. I'm uh, level 67, by the way. Uh, that the community, out of necessity, is going to grow closer again, come closer together, so it's going to be, the the servers will actually be servers, and no sharding, and no server-wide, um, you know, uh, what are they called, battle groups, I believe. It'll be, everything will be on your server, and so what that means, exactly, case in point, um, the comment you see at the bottom left here in, in the chat, FML, so many stupid people, if you are not going to behave in a battleground, in a group for a dungeon, or am I that's so little? Um, if you're not going to behave, and you're just, quite frankly, are being a dick, people will recognize you, will remember you, and will quite simply not invite you anymore, as you recall. in. Uh, in classic, there are no group finders um, for dungeons. Are you coming, son? You are. Or um, battle uh, battleground queue methods. Anything. You actually do have to find somebody, find group, find people that invite you to an actual group. It's kind of like uh, raided battlegrounds, but for every single battleground there is. And uh, same for dungeons and raids, of course, and so on, right? And so, if you're going to be a dick to the peers on your server, they are going to remem remember you as they have in original classic. There were some people that were quite simply not invited to any sort of group content anymore. So I hope that this 
really unfounded negativity is going to stop. People are being nicer, people are going to trade a little bit more with each other, it's going to more be more of a community just to do to do anything. On the flip side though, and that is where I am not sure how much I can actually play classic. On the flip side, the uh, specifically the battleground finder, which I use obviously all the time and every time, as well as the, the dungeon finder tools, they are not there anymore, which means for me, I'm going to have a lot harder time finding a group, not because I'm a dick, at least I hope, but because I simply don't have the time to play that much. If you want to do a battleground in classic or wanted to, and I assume it's going to be exactly the same, you have to be on some sort of um, either secondary website or tertiary website, which existed at that point, you know, like kind of group finder websites that people... Can you stop that? That uh, people created. It's going to be okay. I don't actually see because my camera is right in front of me. Um, my health, I don't actually see my health. You could hear me. Oh no, wait. I'm actually not sure if I have some other skills. I'm still having and getting used to this guy. So, you have to find a group. You have to be accepted to the group. You have to have the 10, 15 people, however many people you need for a battleground or, you know, five for a dungeon. And then you actually have to go to wherever the portal is. So going into a battleground or a dungeon from wherever you are, so the group finder tool is not going to happen anymore. So if you're questing somewhere, wherever, and the dungeon you're going to is on a different continent, on the far side of the continent, you actually have to fly to the Zeppelin or whatever there is on the Alliance side. Um, go over to the other continent, find the flight path, then fly over to wherever you need to go. You know, if you're a mage, you're going to have a, an easier time, and I think Warlocks will be in high demand specifically for that kind of stuff. But um, flight paths, there weren't as many as there are now. I believe the flight speed was also slower, so it's going to take, I don't know, half an hour maybe, just an assumption, to um, get into a battleground, you know, a little bit less probably to get into a dungeon because you only need five people. And that currently really doesn't work for me. You know, as you guys probably know, I have a family and a full-time job. Well, more than a full-time job. Working 50 hours, probably probably minimum a week. And then, yeah, I go home and do some uh, family stuff, dinner and so on. And yeah, my time is really limited. Do I even have my pet? Um, so yeah, this is going to be problematic for me. So I will most definitely play and uh, start on. Come on, why didn't this go through? On the classic server, yeah. You know, try to figure out, see how it all goes, because I'm also quite quite looking forward to the the constant gear grind to stop. I think that'll be another positive, at least for me personally. Where, you know, I'll be okay to run around in greens for a while, you know, get a couple of blues. I don't need to be all purple and so on. Uh, I think that's going to be quite neat. Maybe I should focus on the healer. It's going to be quite neat knowing exactly where you need to go to in order to get certain amount of gear or certain gears. Um, you need to be a lot more targeted. There is no titan forging and that kind of garbage. Um, you just basically know what you're gonna get and can be, can be very specific spread the love a little bit, about um, how you gear and know what you get, know what you got as well, know what other people will have. And yeah, I'm, I think I'm quite looking forward to that. That and the community, I think this can be good. Then I just have to figure out if I can manage at all with the time involvement. Because I like to do PvP obviously, as you guys know. Hey, we won! Oh, that's awesome! Um, yeah, I like to do PvP, and I like to do some uh, content, this is actually pretty good. I went 4 and 1, I did the right damage too. And um, yeah, you know, like, if I if I get to do a raid, um, which will need a lot of preparations, because just like when you do, you know, I guess, um, if you're pushing content, you need to be prepared, you need to have your flask and your food, and everything, um, 
like raid finder where you just kind of queue up and you do stuff and then you win and you get some stuff that's not gonna happen in uh in classic either um yeah so i'm looking forward to that to um you know getting the gear doing some of the the grind but knowing that not in like two months there'll be a new expansion or you know what just happened here in bfa with one point uh, uh, 8.1.5 they just kind of up the level a little bit to get better gears doing the same stuff before so that's not going to happen so I'm, I think I'm quite looking forward the uh, forward to the longevity of leveling and then grinding gear and um, yeah just uh, moving forward on uh, you know on a, on a specific character basis anyways guys um, do let me know if you like this content, you know, I'm kind of a WoW veteran, even though I still suck. If there's any more questions or if there's anything else you want to talk about, do let me know. Hit me up, please, with a comment, a sub, or a like. I would love it. And thank you, guys. And, yeah, hope to see you soon. Bye now.